Hi everyone, welcome to day 4 of my 50 days SQL challenge series where I solve data analyst and business analyst interview question for SQL. Today I will be solving one of the recent interview question that was asked to one of my subscriber. I have received this request yesterday on my YouTube channel. So let's see the question first. Hey, I have one SQL interview question where I was unable to solve this in the interview. So the question is, so this is the basically kind of table and uh, this is the question. Find the top 2 products in the top 2 categories based on the total span. So, uh, you know, we will be solving this question. This was basically asked to one of my, you know, subscriber recently. So let's just go back to, you know, PG admin 4 where I have created this table to solve these questions. And I'll show you step by step how you can basically solve these questions. So I have kind of created the same table and this is the questions which we'll be solving today. So the question says that find the top two product in the top two categories based on the spend amount. Okay, so let's see the table. So in the table we have category, we have product, we have user ID, span and the transactions date. So what we need to basically find out the top two product in each uh, you know category and this that category has to be like the top two category again. So based on the spend amount, based on basically this column. Okay. So to solve this question first, let's just write down the things that we need. Okay. So first we need to find out the top two category based on the spend amount. So we'll say top two, you know, top two category based on the based on span right based on total span the second we need to find out basically top two product in this top two category right so that's what we need to find out right so top two product in above best two category right so this is need to basically you know we need to basically do this you know to basically solve these questions so let's start writing our query so i'll first select the category okay and then i will basically select uh you know something called sum so i'll basically i want to see for each category what is the total span amount so that i can find out the top two category okay so i'll say sum of spend and uh, i will just name it as like total spend dash category so basically this is going to be total spend for that particular category okay so i'll be doing a group by to find out uh, the category and their basically total spend right then i can basically find out top two you know category based on the higher spend so i would say the tables okay and i would say group by group by by this category right by this column which is category so now if I just run it, I will have the category and their spend. Now you can see if I can show you, this is the category which is toys that has the higher spend amount that is 954 and the second I think this is the one which is the second electronics. Now I can basically do an order by that's how I can basically filter out top two category right. So that's also fine but I'll be using a you know basically window functions called dance rank to basically you know do this you know solve this problem. The reason is that there could be two or more category with the same spend amount so I want to ensure that I'm selecting the top two category based on the total spend amount so if there are two category having the same spend amount I'm selecting both the categories okay so I'll be using dense rank here if you do not know about dense rank window functions do leave a comment I'll make a video very soon so I will say dense rank and dense rank goes with this uh, syntax which is over so inside the over I want to basically order this data so I will say order by this column which is sum of spend okay because I want to basically order this data based on this spend amount so higher spend would come on the first then I want to give some ranking okay so spend descending and I want to name this column as DRN okay now what will happen basically it will create a new window and based on the higher spend we will basically get a ranking one so that's how we can basically filter to rank uh, to you know kind of uh, data to rank and that's how we will be getting like top two category okay so let's just go ahead and create this uh, you know window so i can just run it now you can see the higher spend the data is basically sorted by this dense rank inside the, i mean this order by inside this rank, dense rank so it is sorted and it's basically giving some ranking now i can filter this data by only up to two that's how i get top two category now if there are two category having the same spend amount then still i will be getting like uh, you know the top two category basically the three category where uh, the two category will have the same spend amount right so that's the reason i'm using a uh, dense ring now i can go ahead and do a filter by you know this column which is drn so and then how that's how i'll be getting top two categories name right so i can just go ahead and say to uh, do a filter by this column because this is not a you know a, i mean column in the main table so i'll need to basically use a sub query to come out of this uh, you know query and then i can do a filter so i can say select so i want to select from here i want to select only what i want to select this category only okay and uh, from where from basically this uh, inner query so i'll just put this in an inner query and i would say i'm just putting this in a bracket okay so i'll just explain how it's working so now this is going to be running uh, this is going to run first then it will return the category now i will say i want the category only where 
this drn where this this column is basically less than equals to 2 that's how i select the top two category names okay so i would say less than oops i would say less than equals to 2 that's how i kind of select top two category now i can just show you oops i'm saying oh sorry drn okay this is the column name i need to keep now i'm selecting the top two category based on the higher span now you can see that i can also add one more column just to show you okay i can say that i want this column as well here okay now i can see i have like top two category and their total span right that is fine now i can save this data in a cte okay i can go ahead and say that i want to save this data in a cte so to to save this first i let me just give a alias as sub query okay I'm just giving alias to this query as a sub query now i will save this data in a cte okay so i would uh, say with ranked category category now if you do not know about cte leave a comment i'll make a video very soon cte basically kind of uh, you know creating a kind of you know temporary table and storing the data okay so i'm just kind of creating a temporary table and storing this data so i'll just say comment okay let me just organize the query bit so now this is the syntax in cte while you are creating cte you kind of uh, you know give with then the name of the cte and you use s and inside the parenthesis you basically put your query so now this all the query that we have this is going to store this uh, you know this is going to store this data like this table inside this rank category okay so now other than that what we need basically now now see we need something like product also so we we can find out basically uh, in each category the top you know a product based on the span right so we need that the second things which is top two product in each category i would say top two product in each category this is what we need right so we can go ahead and say select this time we'll select category okay and also products now i will say sum of span okay i'll do a simple group by so sum of span and i will say total spend by what product earlier spend was basically by category now i'm basically drilling down to the product level so first i will do group by the category then i will do group by the product and for each product i will basically have the spend amount then i can do some filter by you know filter to select for each category what are the top two basically you know product then i can kind of compare these two you know and i will be selecting only two category from this table and for those two category i'll be getting basically the top two product based on the spend okay so i can say from from orders okay so i'm saying from order select category select product some of the spend and uh, basically naming this column as this i'll just give some comma here now i need to do group by by the category because these are the categorical column the category and product so i will say group by group by by this category okay and comma i also want to do group by by this product now this is done now the, if i just simply run it you will see that i am getting for each category like this is the category name for each category i am getting the product and their you know total sale amount right now what i can do is basically i can create a new window here and i can do a partition by the category so for each category i will have the all the product and their total sale and i can do some basically order by by the total sale that's how i will be getting the you know for each category the product that has higher sale that would be get uh, getting ranking one and then the second product which has the second higher uh, you know higher sale that will get the ranking two so i can do that and i will be using dense rank for that okay so let me just show you dense rank now this time i will be using over and i will be using something called partition by partition by so what i am basically doing i am basically grouping the data based on i am doing a partition based on the category and for each category i will have all the product name and for each product i want to find out the sum and then i want to order the data inside each category based on the higher span okay so i am saying partition by this category partition by this category and i would say you know order by this sum okay order by this sum descending and i will just name this column as p which means p d r n okay you can give any name i will just give as p r n p d r n okay so this is the name i'm giving so still i'm i'm basically simply so the table is same i'm just using a new column i'm just creating a new column using window functions to basically kind of sort the data and giving some ranking okay now i can just go ahead and run it still i'm not connected with this you know cte this is completely separate so far so you see now what is actually happening is that for each category 
we are having all the product name and based on their sales I'm getting the rank so I can just show you for a category like toys so in the toys we have two products so first product which is higher sale that is 576 that is getting rank 1 now the second product which is the second higher sale that is getting rank 2 now if you check for electronics we have two product vacuum and wireless so vacuum is getting 341 wireless is getting two, uh, 250 so whatever the product we have inside that category that will basically get a ranking like 1 2 3 4 5 6 whoever is getting the higher sale that will get rank 1 okay now let's say appliance in appliance i think let's see okay so in appliance as well also we have kind of two products okay now in electronics we have two products I think yeah in electronic you can see that we have three products so one is vacuum which is getting the higher seal 341 and that's getting ranking one now wireless that's getting ranking two now we have TV that's getting ranking three so that means if we select electronics and uh, this uh, TV that is basically 181 this will not be selected because this is not the rank two right this is not the top uh, you know under top two uh, you know basically a product based on the you know spend so now we can basically go ahead and filter this data by this you know only column right by this uh, this column by saying that where uh, you know PDRN is less than equals to 2 because we only want to select for each category we want to select only up to 2 ranking that's how we select the top 2 product from each category right so I can go ahead and say where PDRN less than equals to 2 correct so if I just run it it's going to basically you know give me the solution that's fine now the thing is that I only want to select top 2 category now we know that the category name from we can get it from this table the category name if I just uh, run it again if I just show you again so the category name was oops I just run it again so the category name was toys and electronics now we also have category name in this table as well right now if I just run it again you can check in this table we have all the category name which is you know um, so we might have to, okay we can just ignore it for now so in this table as well also we have the category name right so we can kind of make a join between this uh, CTE and between this table and that's how we can basically kind of only uh, you know make an inner join between these two tables that's how we will only select the top two category and their product and kind of their you know kind of what their you know uh, ranking of each product right so we can do that so we can uh, do that so for now to use this you know to use this functions I need to basically go out of this query and then I need to use a kind of you know uh, sub query then I can do a filter by because this is not a physical column in this table this is just a, a you know column that I have created using this window functions so for now I'll just keep it as a comment and let's just do one thing okay let's just join this table with this table so that we can only select the data for top two category right so then inside this top two category we will be getting product and their ranking so how do you do that I can just simply use a join here okay I can say orders as O so I'm joining this orders table, the main table with this uh, CTE, the virtual table that we have created. So I can say join, okay, join with what? Join with this, okay. Now, this is I'm giving a name for this table as RC because this is a very long name. So I'll just give a short name RC, okay. Now joining one what? So they both the table like this rank table and this main our product order table, they have same column which is category, right? So I can join on this condition. So I can say on RC dot category equals to o dot category okay now basically we are making a join between these two uh, you know uh, this and this right so I can just go ahead and run it if we just show you okay I might have okay so uh, yeah I need to basically select where I'm getting uh, you know this column so category I'm getting from let's say orders table okay and this product I'm getting from orders table so see this O means this orders right so I spend I'm getting from orders table that's fine and then I'm doing some partition so this category also I'm getting from what orders table and this pen I'm getting from the orders table okay this is fine now uh, this RC everything is fine now it should basically work fine let's just go ahead and you know run it still okay now yeah so we need to basically do the group by as well right so I would say group by which is o dot rc so o dot rc and the product dot rc so this things I'm getting basically from I'm just giving their you know aliases you know to ensure that we're selecting from the right table now see what what we're getting basically we are getting top two category so first category which is electronics and the second category that is toys okay and they're all the product and they're basically kind of sales amount now you can see in electronics we have three products first product that is basically uh, that is getting the higher sale which is 341 second product is getting 250 third product is getting 189 
similarly the second uh, category that we have which is toys so toys we have only two products and their sales amount see now the question was to basically select top two products from top two category now we know the top two categories are this now but what we need to basically find out is that we need to only select top two product now only we need to select like this two product and this two product and how we can do that we can simply filter the data by basically this you know column which is pdrn right we can just filter this data by this column we can say that if the pdrn which is this if this product rank is less than equals to two that means select that so if i just say if it is less than equals to two like this if i just run this it is going to select two uh you know product from this uh you know uh, kind of category and two product from this category so that's how we get basically from top two category we get top two product based on the spend amount okay so now i can just go ahead and do that but the thing is that this is not a physical column in this table so i need to come out of this table and then i can basically kind of you know make aware conditions here right so i can either use one more sub query here or i can use a ct here so let's just do one thing okay let me just use uh one more sub query here okay let's see if, if it if we can work with the sub query so i can say select what i want i want to select category which is the first column then i want to select product product okay and uh, i want to select this as well total spend amount okay all these things i'm getting from this table okay and this table is connected basically with the previous table so i can say from i need to use the alias now inside this basically sub query i'm going to put everything okay like so this whole table which is basically kind of making join group by and everything so i have put everything inside this now i can give us uh, alias call uh, sub query two, okay now from this table i'm getting all these things now in this table i have a column which is this one right pdrn right and this whole table is basically getting saved uns you know inside this sub query now from this sub query i'm getting product you know category product id and total spend amount which is basically this column now i can use a you know where functions like this one Okay, I can just use these functions to basically say that okay I need all the product where this uh, you know uh, the PDRN basically P tens rank less than equals to 2 if I just now run it you will see it will basically return me top 2 category and inside those top 2 category it will return only 2 product which has the highest you know sale amount so let's just run it now you can see we have the answer so these are the two product that is we are getting from each category based on the higher so you can see the third product which was i think tb that was 181 that is not selected because that is not falling under this criteria so this is how we can basically solve really complex uh, problem or interview question using sql so the main thing that you need to focus is that basically think uh, logically and try to break the you know, question in basically smaller problems i would say and then you can kind of solve this kind of problems okay so i have a task for you you need to find the or top category from the top category you need to find the product that has uh, you know least spend amount okay so that's going to be your task you can write down your solutions in the comments i would review them and let you know if you are correct okay